What's going on? It's your boy Ropex back with another Blade Ball update video. Yes, sir. Yes, we got sir. a new yes, update Blade Ball. Weekly updates. Be out here making them bang. So as you can see right off the bat, I'm holding the newest shield in the game. And you can get the shield for $3.99 or the blue cool version for $34.99. Isn't this worth it? It's even broken. Oh my god, this is so worth $3,500 Robux. Oh my god, $35. Bucks. Wow. You know what the jokes, but it kind of does look cool, but, but it's broken right now. So that's that. So if you guys want the red shield, join my Discord and subscribe. If you have not already, I will be giving you a random subscriber the red shield. So make sure you guys comment your username and join the discord to enter the giveaway i'll pick a random winner from one of my videos that commented and they'll win and they also have to be in our discord anyways so the next part of the update is the newest ability that i showcased a bit a while ago the ability is called force it looks pretty cool now going by the description release three consecutive shockwaves which launch nearby players away and the upgrade gives larger radius and dark force ability reskin okay i brought my alt account to test out the newest ability just to showcase for you guys and also if you guys want the 2.3 million i made a video about how you can get anything with zero robux on playball and that is not click it check it out below okay it's starting so let's see the effect Ooh, the effect on the weapon is cool <gasps> and they changed this thing which is red it looks way cooler now there's also like when you kill two people you get it like Dual kill, double kill, three people, same thing, it goes up. I'm looking a lot cooler now on the GUI side of things. There was a white thing here, but they seem to have removed that. Now let's check out the ability. It doesn't even move the ball away. Was I wrong? Was my prediction false? I thought it would push away the ball. Or is it just nearby players that it pushes away? Okay, so let's test this out near a player. Oh, okay, so it only seems to push away players near you, not the ball. Only those players near you. So to be honest, in my own opinion, this ability is just useful for people that like camping and cowering. No offense, guys. You know who I'm talking about. Yeah, you. If you're watching the video, just cowering in a corner. You know who I'm talking about. You don't be doing it. Let's check out the VFX on the weapon. Oh, okay. So it's not as cool as the 3500 one. I could have swore this Halloween thing was two days left. They've changed it to 9 days. I guess they need more time for a new update. Okay, so you could get this ability, which I thought I bought it for 3000 and maximized it for 4500 But it seems instead of giving us another weapon, it gives us the ability for free once we complete the 100 XP challenges. Now, if we look here, there's no initial upgrade or anything, but there is a change that happened in rank. I can't go into ranked and show you this, but what the change in rank is, is basically if you disconnect from a ranked match, you can reconnect back into it now so that's a pretty good lifesaver for a high beat people that actually care about ranked and don't want to lose elo by accidentally disconnecting from the game now there is one more thing that i have not shown you guys yet and it's pretty cool but the developers have not yet announced this and from my predictions it's going to be a new bundle way to get it the newest thing is rainbow explosion as you see right here now i'm predicting that it's going to be the same as the cyber bundle or any of these bundles where you had to buy it and if i am right then you guys have to subscribe right away because this is a guess the developers haven't said anything about it they also have these new lightning thing but yeah who cares about that the rainbow explosion looks really cool i guess there wasn't much in this update because that is all i can show you everything else is just gui cleaning bug fixes like the gifting system when you offline gifted someone apparently it didn't work now they fixed it if you guys did get offline gifted something and it's not in your inventory contact the developers or moderators whoever you can by creating a support ticket in their discord server because i don't want you guys to lose your robux right so make sure you guys have the proof and you contact the dev team support team i guess Anyways guys, we're trying to hit 10k by the end of this year, so if you guys have not subscribed, it would help us out a lot if you just press that subscribe button and see you guys in the next video.